talking a lot about food because it's one of the main things that I need to educate people on. It's one of the main things I find myself talking about in practice every day and trying to help people best understand is what type of diet to eat and what they might want to consider doing to try and help themselves. So I'm going to tell you, here's, here's a basic tip. If you're having problems with chronic symptoms and Hashimoto's, then the place to start is with eating real food. That means non-processed food, guys. It means non-processed food. So one of the things is, I mean, there's people say, well, what do I eat? Well, there's a lot of different diets that may be beneficial, but the reality is, is it's the diet that's best for you as an individual because people that are autoimmune all have different triggers and drivers of their process. So, guys, I'm sorry I'm breathing hard, but it's hundred and about 62 degrees, and it's hot, and I'm sweating a lot. So I'm actually, my heart rate's up a bit. So um, the thing about the diet is, so if, I'm, if, I, if I seem winded, it's because it's, it's work. <laughs> as much as I like it in here, it's work. Um, so the, um, the best diet is the diet that's best for you, and that's going to be dependent upon a lot of things. What type of foods do you react to? What type of food sensitivities do you have? Uh, what... Uh, what's your digestive tract health? How well can you handle and tolerate um, fluctuations in blood sugar? Like, what's your blood sugar uh, tolerance? How how well can you stabilize it? Um, there's a ton of different things that factor into what's best for you. And the best thing that you can do, the best thing is really to get someone to help you assess and determine your unique contributing factors that will help determine what the best diet and approach is for you. I mean, ideally, what you want to do is you want to look at the diet. You want to you want to change their diet if it's not already great. Only vegetables, minimal low glycemic fruits. Hey guys, Dr. Shook, thank you for viewing our videos. I hope they help you out. If you want to, just subscribe to our channel somewhere here. You can watch a video um, that YouTube's actually selected for you, so hopefully it'll help you out. If you need any other information or resources, just look in the description. We've got links to our website, to our nine lab test guidebook, and everything else that we do. I really appreciate you, and I hope you guys have a great day.